OK, you want to restore deleted files, and this video assumes that you've deleted them from the recycle bin. Now, your first step is to go to your Start button, bottom left of your screen, and then you want to search for the Microsoft Store. Now, you might see it here, but if not, just click up into the search bar and type Store, and then select the Microsoft Store as it appears in the results list. Up in the search bar within the Microsoft Store, just type Windows File Recovery. So you should see the app here, and it is actually a Microsoft app. Now I've already installed it. You will need to install it by clicking on the Install button. So once it's installed, it will probably open automatically, but if it doesn't for some reason, you can either click on Open here, or if I close this down, you can go back to your Start button, and it might appear here in the recently added list. Or if not, just go to All Apps. All these apps are in alphabetical order. So if we go down to the Ws, there we are, Windows File Recovery. So this is the app. It may look intimidating if you're not used to using command prompts, but it's actually very easy to use. So you always start with the characters Win F R. And then you specify the drive that the files were previously on. So for me, that's going to be the C drive. Then you put in a space and you specify the drive that you're going to restore these files to. Now, it has to be a different drive. So it might be a USB drive or you might have partitioned your C drive. So anyway, the drive I'm going to restore to is E colon. So then you'd want to put your filters in. So for example, I just want to restore PDF files. Now to apply that filter, put another space in, then a forward slash N, and then after that N, I would specify my filter. So I want all PDF files. So I'd start with an asterisk, so it can be a PDF with any name, dot PDF. Now if I press Enter, it'll basically ask me whether I want to continue, and I need to specify Y for yes, I want to continue. So then start scanning your drive. So it will then give you a list of recovered files and then ask you whether you want to view the recovered files. So if I say yes, I can then see the folder with the recovered files. And if I go into the subfolders, I can see those PDFs. So hopefully somewhere in those folders will be the particular PDF that you wanted to recover. Now, I've given you a very simple example of a command line that you can use with this application. I've left a link in the description of this video to this web page on the Microsoft website, which will take you through more complex command lines that you could create. So it gives you an idea of a basic command prompt and then some examples. You mainly want to recover files from a particular subfolder within the C drive. It gives you an example of how to do that there. You may want to retrieve both PDF and Microsoft Word documents. It gives you an example there. And there are other examples that you can look at on this page. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next video.